a favor and sh how many views does this uh, one have? Because they're master podcasters, right? So they should be doing right, pretty yeah. good. As no, opposed to me, crushing. who is a, a horrible talker, a slow talker, a mouth breather, all that. Um, let's check their views here. Oh, shit. We just got good news? Yeah, Ela just sent this in the chat. That's the website one, right? I oh, yeah. I think was so. Supposed to tell you. Yo, yeah, wait, hold on. We just got breaking plan. news. Hold on. Yeah, let me get this. I, I just got a mail, too. Okay. Breaking news, guys. Uh, am I under That's the website one, right? Yeah, it is. Breaking uh, news. Ryan Kavanaugh has just lost another lawsuit against us. Woo! Ryan Kavanaugh, he first lost the first lawsuit against us, the tortious interference one, took the L. Now I'm proud to announce that his effort to remove does Ryan Kavanaugh look like Harvey Weinstein has failed. The court has ruled that does Ryan Kavanaugh look like Harvey Weinstein is a legitimate institution. <laughs> it cannot be removed. We are not impersonating him. And there you have it. The website shall remain in all of its glory. Hallelujah. Wow. That's two down, baby. Two to go. How about you suck these fucking nuts, Ryan, you bitch. Loser. Fuck. Hope that pillow fighting uh, championship goes well for you. <laughs> hey, J hey, Ryan, do they have pillow fights in prison? Because I'm pretty sure you're going to be going there soon. For fraud and stuff. Yeah, nothing related to you. Say that again, Ryan. Inappropriate relationship by the 14 year old Natalie Portman. Mm. Oh, yeah, he's right. going to jail. Oh, yeah. So, Ryan, I hope you're watching this. Uh, if you just watch anything, it's suck this fucking tiny Jewish cock, you bitch. <laughs> and shout out to Brad the Bull, who's giving it to his wife good every night, ladies and gentlemen. Gave it up to Brad the Brad. Bull. You know he looks Woo! good. He knows how to lay the D. And she is very satisfied thanks to Brad the Bull. <laughs> hey, Ryan, how does it feel to lose? You fucking piece of shit. You're never going to take this down. Suck my fucking dick. You're a giant piece of shit. You're used to suing people and getting your way. Not today, you fucking dickless bitch. I hope you're crying and feeling sad, you pathetic loser. That's two down, four to go. The website stays up because let's face it, Ryan, Wait, only it's free speech. Two down, two to go. Two down, two to go. Okay. I was like, are there two more that I don't know oh, about? What did I say? You said two down, four to go. I was no, like, oh, sorry. shit. Two down, two to go. Yeah. Suck my fucking dick. Yeah. Hey. Yeah, no, I know. It's a, it's, the, uh, yeah. No, it's okay. So, Ryan, you can suck my dick. Hey, Ryan, you can suck my dick. Hey, Ryan, you can suck my dick. My big, fat, juicy, tiny dick. It's juicy, but it's small. You can fit it in your mouth. Hi, I'm Dick You Jeff. can ride this dick, you little fucking piece of shit. Hey. Ride my fucking dick. Woo! Woo! Let's kick it up. Ride my dick. Ryan is a piece of shit, ride said my, uh. what? Let's kick it off. Ryan is a piece of shit. Uh, throw your hands uh, in the air. Throw your, th throw your hands in the air. Ryan is a fucking piece of shit. Oh, come on. Ow. Let's throw it up. Not because you're a piece of shit. Damn. Let's go to the website, everybody, to celebrate. <laughs> Type Ryan Kavanaugh on the Google. <laughs> this website's not going anywhere. And that is Ryan Kavanaugh is a force of nature. He sure is, Harvey. <laughs> he sure is a force of nature. Suck my fucking dick. Now, a lot of people said going up against a billionaire, not a great idea, Ethan. But you know what I say to them? Fuck Ryan Kavanaugh. Nobody will ever infringe on my right to free speech. I will always defend myself against all fucking odds, against all reason. I will stand up to do the right thing. And Ryan, you're taking the L's. L. You should change your name to L. You changed your name to Elian Lavinaw. That's his, the, his name with L's in the front. Elian Lavinaw. Wow. Got him. The fuck you? That was a piece of shit. Lion Kavanaugh. Woo! Lion Ryan. So this Lion one, Ryan. Why Lion Ryan. Lion Ryan. So this one we can't um, pursue legal fees on, but the, the one we won last time, we can and we are. 
And the two remaining is the copyright one and the uh, defamation one, which I'm feeling good about. And those ones we can pursue legal fees on. So I think Ryan's going to take up. I'm just feeling good, you know, that's two out of four. And you know, when you sue someone four times, and let's just say hypothetically he loses all four of them, that's a not a good look. That looks like legal harassment. Like, and you know, I mean, God, that guy sucks so bad. I mean, what a fucking bitch he is, right? Yeah, he sucks. Brian Ryan. Oh, well, at least his wife is getting it good. You know. So why did someone say this isn't about you, Ethan? It's about love? <laughs> is that a joke? I don't know. Well, anyway, um, <laughs> this is awesome. I'm super happy. Lion Ryan La Lavinoff. Lion Ryan Lavinoff. Yeah, it is legal harassment. I mean, there's straight, straight up. Oh, l wait, t Tate's live chatting? No, this is from the video we were just reacting to. This was his live chat. <laughs> this is the best comment from his live chat. Look, he has Tourette's laughing face like, what a fucking loser. <laughs> He's a loser. He was born with Tourette's. Wah! And then the other one. Ela just gave $10, by the way. Oh, thank you, us. generous queen. To just write L's over and over again. L, 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 L. Another one. Uh, uh, he is Jew. He is a Jew and pro-Israel. I'm not pro-Israel. Where, where, where does that come from? I mean, the Jew part is probably the more telling. Right. Element of that comment. I get the feeling <laughs> these guys are What they're getting at there, yeah. I get the feeling that uh, these guys aren't too interested in the uh, politics. <laughs> Go on, Keemstar. I'm not. I'm scared how you're going to end that one. Death to all Jews. But there you go. Keemstar said I was going to go to jail. Keemstar hates the Jews. And so far, we're looking pretty good. I'm feeling really good. I'm really happy the website's staying up, you know? Yo, this is the best oh, one yeah. yet that you just found, AB. This is, this is quite the insult. He uses his brain to pay for Big Mac. That's why he's so slow. <laughs> epic. Epic own right there. What? It's almost it's nonsense. <laughs> it's just... It really doesn't make sense at all. It doesn't make any sense. <laughs> <laughs> well, that, that's great news. I'm, I'm, I'm very happy. It would have honestly been such a tragic blow if that website went down. But I think he knew that it was a long shot. It's just a pathetic, another pathetic attempt to try to drain me of my funds and just give in. But that ain't ever gonna happen. Do you understand that, Ryan? I will spend every fucking dime I have uh, to defend my rights. Okay. This is America, Ryan. Last I checked. And it means something to be an American. Hasta la vista, baby. It's really true. This guy sues everybody for anything, and it usually works. I mean, he called us a toy podcast once a while ago. How's this toy podcast doing for you, Ryan? Anyway, uh, can he be uh, another comment? Pull that one up, Dan. Sure. And you know it's going to be fire when you got an anime profile. He picture. says that guy makes his staff wear masks while they film their podcasts as well. <laughs> I mean, we did for like a yeah. week when we had a COVID scare. That seems reasonable. Yeah, yeah. And like at the height of the lockdown, when it was when basically, yeah, when all businesses were shut down, but we had an exemption for being entertainment. Yo, this dude doesn't even drink sparkling water, bro. <laughs> water, sparkling water. Gosh. That one baffled. It still baffles. His viewers, about, a, his viewers will agree. Cause oh wait, did can you find their views? Because I did want to do that. He did. Seventy-three k, sir. That's this podcast has 73k views. Mm -hmm. Okay, I have to admit, that's more than I thought they would be having. I would have that's... thought like 12k. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, that's a, more than I expected. But I don't know if I need to pull up my podcast because uh, I'm just going to say this. Clearly people like listening to me talk more uh, than you guys. Just saying. The numbers don't just lie, saying. boys. Just saying. And I'm not here to toot my own horn, but come on now. Just saying. Somebody said real cute toy podcast, wasn't it? With 
Isn't that what Kavanaugh said about you? Yeah, that's what I just said. He said, oh, okay. when he sent his threatening right, Instagram right. message to me, he said, I don't know what you think you're doing with your toy podcast, <laughs> but you're messing with real things here and has real consequences. <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, so here's the expectation of what uh, Cobra Taint does, and here's the reality. He's actually on the school bus. <laughs> oh, no. He, he, like I said, he grooms, he gets them young. Mm -hmm. And just like a model scout, uh, you know, for his webcam get thing. Type of people, the type of person who watches that kind of guy for entertainment is that kind of guy. His brain is so slow. He can't even speak quickly. <laughs> and I'm trying what are you talking about? I've got, I got stuff to do, right? I'm a... Oh, I'm, what? This <laughs> I honestly can't even say anything. They're just shouting, blah, blah, blah. he's poor, he's fat, he can't talk fast. Since when is talking fast uh, a favorable uh, attribute? Talking fast? I, I mean, never heard that. It can be contextually, but you know, it, it's not inherently. Talk fast? Talk you put that on your resume or something? Talk real like... fast. <laughs> If I sit down, I want to. Okay, tell me. I mean, I don't do. I didn't do a line before my show like you guys clearly did. He doesn't speak particularly fast either. He just is loud. He seems to be speaking at a fairly regular pace. I would say. We gotta remember, this is the guy that doesn't have time to cook. Except cooking's for poor people. Right, right, right. right, right. So or, or rich people actually. Rich people. Well, cooking's for morons and rich people because they have the time. Let's go. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, people that shout like this, I think, are insecure in what they're saying, so they shout to make it seem more interesting. Put information, insult me, get it over with. So I'm sitting there, and I'm using it. Anyway, I looked at this YouTube. I was like, I can't even watch this. It's fucking awful. Like, you need somebody to no, do a super I, I ain't even mad. I ain't even mad. Of course people like that. I, you know what? If Wait. people like that didn't hate us, we're doing something wrong. Um, the biggest own of all is the fact that they don't mention being arrested for human trafficking. Basically, that's that's the biggest own. I mean, that's checkmate right there. We cut it short, but they went on. They said some nasty things about Eli yeah. that we didn't even want to show. But. Why? Let's watch it. That's good stuff. What do they say? I mean, it's good. Let's come on. Not, uh, Eva's secure about herself. She's not going to make these bozos make her feel bad. Yeah, Trust me, I, I only want it for the entertainment value. Um, Eva gets this shit all the time. She's very secure, as am I. They're not going to make her feel bad. I just want to know how low these guys go. To basically avoid saying that we were arrested for human trafficking. Let's see. I mean, at least she's with me by, by choice. You know, at least my wife chooses to be with me, unlike your fucking partners who shackle into a small room and make them webcam. <laughs> Like, I try to get a woman to willfully stay with you for more than six months, bro. See how that works out. Oh, wait. Hang on. Should we do that? So this is it. This oh, God. She looks so beautiful. Like, you're going to be stretching to try to make it sound like she's not gorgeous. Okay, so let's see. Let's see how they do. Seriously? Seriously? Uh, uh, you can't even steal that guy's wife because we cannot be seen with a woman of that caliber in the compound but what or she, in public. But what if she... In the compound. <laughs> I know what that means. Holds the camera. Yo, if I if I was next, first of all, Ela's gorgeous. Everybody knows that. He's if I was dating oh, like a. a, a, a tell, tell, what's a beautiful woman's name? Nobody right. can think of one? What the fuck? I mean, of a celebrity? Yeah. Kim Kardashian. No, that's not a good one. I knew, I knew you wouldn't accept that. <laughs> uh, uh, what's your name? Fucking the girl who was... Dua Lipa. Okay, Dua Lipa. If I was next to Dua Lipa, they'd be like, Dude, I can would never be caught with a girl of this caliber. Like, no matter how beautiful the girl is, they'd be like, Oh, no, she's the worst looking girl I've ever seen. Yeah. <laughs> Sorry, Ela's objectively gorgeous. Take the L, bitch. She, you know what? I think we might fire Scott Adams' wife and hire Ethan's wife. Should we do that? So this is it. This is why we don't get girls, and this is his wife. Let me tell you something, Ethan. I would rather sleep in a bed by myself every night for the rest of my life than marry a woman who looks like that. 
So well, first, uh, to, first of all, you have to find someone who wants to marry you first. Which I have a feeling is going to be very difficult for you guys. But, uh, again. Yeah. Dua Lipa would be like, this is disgusting. What a fucking fat B word. Even if I didn't get girls, I'm doing better than you. That's Be negative girls. That's minus girls. What are you saying? Jesus Christ. Right. I'm sorry, but like no matter how Still hard like they try to pretend like Ela's uh, ugly, she is gorgeous and you can't you can't even <laughs> nobody's even believing this. I mean, she's not she looks great. You found some. But you know, it's sort it's your life out. You know what like Scott, I love the fact that Christina moves my cam while Scott Adams watching kids. So what I'm thinking of doing is, Tristan, hear me out. Okay. What if I got two moving cams? Okay. Okay. And they can both move my cameras. I don't want this girl in my house. Bro, Ethan's wife, Scott Adams' wife, both are moving my cameras. And then what I'll do who, is I'll who, tandem put them on who, the same. Who's he talking about? Scott? Um, is that another guy that got beef with or something? I'm not sure about that. It seems like it. So they're talking about kidnapping Ela and putting her in webcam slavery? Oh. It seems oh, like. Oh, by the way. Cheers. Water. Oh, classy. Can I get a soda water so I don't look poor and, and miserable, Absolutely. please, somebody? Yeah. yeah, so they're saying, basically, I'm going to kidnap your wife, put her in the webcam, and put her in uh, uh, human trafficking slavery. Uh, awesome. I actually moved the needle there. Same screen, because I'm done, and that's what I'm about to do. I'm Mr. Producer. That's what's happened for the next show. Two steady cams, two wives. Every single time someone annoys me and I take their wife, we add another steady cam to the, the setup. Until it just gets ridiculously large, the point can no longer get in the room. And they have to have 50 little boxes of moving cameras. And no one understands what's going on. We can label them. And we can label them. And I can just sit there and just talk about everyone's wives that I own as they steadily move the cameras before we go to my bedroom for a steady hand job. Super steady. <laughs> what? I don't even know what the fuck you're talking about. I stepped out to get a drink for a minute, and I'm totally lost with what he's talking about. Every white he, he steals, he's going to add another steady cam to his video setup for the podcast? What's the I don't get the joke. Yeah, there? I don't get it. Maybe I'll go back a bit. I also think he said that he owns, like, people. Or did he mean Yeah, own, like, no, no, owners? that's what he said. I own your wife. Well, yeah, he just got raided by the Romanian police for owning people. That was the problem. Right. That's actually the crime you did commit that you're not mentioning on this show. I was gonna say this, but since they're making fun of Ela, it looks like Tristan is wearing a hairpiece. Oh, you think so? Oh, something does not look natural there. Well, if that's his brother, that hair, you can't explain that hair with this head. Something's going on. There. Like, this guy is bald as fuck. He looks like a fucking hard boiled egg, dude. He's gonna kill me now for saying that, but. Yeah, he's coming to you next, yeah. boy. She looks like. Nah, nah, no. And full respect to, to, to my girl out there, Caitlyn Jenner. She doesn't look like Caitlyn Jenner. She looks like straight up Bruce from the 1970s. And not Bruce Wayne. Dude, you guys are just saying bullshit. Like, come on. <laughs> Try harder to insult her, dude. It's just like ridiculous. No, no, no. Bru me. Bruce Jenner. Jeez, that's his wife? That's his wife. We, so, don't, we don't get girls. That's just another guy we always talk about. Who's the guy who puts the dildos up his bum and, and talks about being really important and thinks he's in charge? Well, this, this guy, this guy probably does do that. No, also. of course he does this, but it's a different guy. And then, and then he, he's, uh, what's his name? Oh, the the uh, bum dildo man. The one who I, fucks. I, I think they're done. I don't know what they're on about, but I yeah. get the idea. Pretty much it. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> No, here's another comment by the same guy. This is the same guy who said I'm a Jew and I'm pro-Israel. Right, yeah. Oh, man, this guy, Sai Ed. Ethan has a very strong bond with Susan, CEO of YouTube. Be careful, guys. It's a very strong bond. You guys are tight. I think that's more Jewish conspiracy shit. Yeah. Shout out Sai Ed. Sai Ed? Uh, who's who's, who's uh, clearly black-pilled AF. Wait, one of their own commenters said that? Yeah. Maybe? Mm -hmm. Oh, maybe he's honest. Nice wig, Tristan. It's from oh! their chat. Oh! Interesting. Yo, Tristan, you have a hairpiece? That Do you know what that means? Like, first of all, no hate, okay? But I'm allowed to make fun of this guy's hairpiece for the very basic fact that he talks about how they have all the genetic blessings and they're perfect human specimens. But Tristan... 
If that's true, why do you glue a fucking skunk to your head? <laughs> like, imagine this guy who thinks he's God's gift to the world going to the